Last updated Jan 12, 2018 11.46 a.m. EST. Senator Dick Durbin, D. Illinois, refuted President Trump's tweeted denials that he used the phrase SH filled countries when discussing legal protections for immigrants from Haiti, El Salvador and African countries. Durbin, who was in the meeting with the President when he made remarks, said of Mr. Trump's denial, It's not true. He said those hateful things, and he said them repeatedly. Durbin attended an event in Chicago Friday and then held a press conference on the president's comments afterward. He told reporters how the issue came up when the question was raised about Haitians. For example, we have a group that have temporary protected status in the United States because they were the victims of crises and disasters and political upheaval. The largest group is El Salvadoran. The second is Honduran and the third is Haitian, and when I mentioned that fact to him, he said Haitians. Do we need more Haitians? And then he went on and started to describe the immigration from Africa that was being protected in this bipartisan measure. That's where he used these vile and vulgar comments, calling the nations they come from as fills, the exact word used by the president not just once, but repeatedly. Mr. Trump on Friday morning tweeted that he had used tough language but denied he had used the profane phrase. The language used by me at the DACA meeting was tough, but this was not the language used. What was really tough was the outlandish proposal made, a big setback for DACA, Donald J. Trump, at Real Donald Trump, January 12, 2018, and he also denied he had said anything insulting about Haitians. We think that he never said anything derogatory about Haitians other than Haiti is, obviously, a very poor and troubled country. Never said take them out. Made up by deems. I have a wonderful relationship with Haitians. Probably should record future meetings, unfortunately, no trust. Never said anything derogatory about Haitians other than Haiti is, obviously, a very poor and troubled country. Never said take them out. Made up by Deems. I have a wonderful relationship with Haitians. Probably should record future meetings, unfortunately, no trust. Donald J. Trump, at Real Donald Trump, January 12, 2018. Durbin said he tried to explain to him why it was he shouldn't use the phrase chain migration, which refers to the process by which immigrants bring their extended family into the U.S. when it came to the issue of chain migration. I said to the president, do you realize how painful the term is to so many people? Durbin recalled. African Americans believe they migrated to America in chains and when you talk about chain migration, it hurts them personally. He said, oh, that's a good line. Durbin's hope for a bipartisan agreement with the president's imprimatur receded somewhat on Thursday, but he said he still plans to forge ahead with the agreement reached by some bipartisan senators Thursday. We're going to prepare our bipartisan agreement for introduction into the Senate next week, Durbin said. If the Republican leadership has a better alternative, bring it forward. If they don't, for goodness sakes, give us a vote.